Welcome to this edition of Eighth and I'll tell you how I got better. I'm glad to be here. But a mission to deliver it. Well, I think that we're, we're talking, we're going to talk about everybody's. Arkansas is the second highest prescriber. Welcome to AFMC TV. I'm Robin Ledbetter. Thank you for joining us. Today I have with me Bruce Donaldson, and he is the Marketplace Compliance Coordinator for Arkansas Insurance Department. Bruce, thanks for being here. Uh, thank you for inviting me. So it's an exciting time. Open enrollment begins November 1st. Um, tell us what that means, and is this a nationwide thing? Yeah, it's it's nationwide. Um and uh, the open enrollment begins November 1st and it goes through January 15th. So those folks that are not insured now can get on a plan for January 1st if they enroll before December 15th and they will have full coverage with no pre-existing conditions. Uh, so they'll have uh, all the essential benefits uh, will be covered. Um, so, but they need to do it between November 1st and January 15th. If they do it after December 15th, they'll get coverage for uh, February 1st. And tell us about the hotline. There's a call center. So Arkansas has its own call center? Yes, we have our own call center uh, at AFMC and they uh, take calls from consumers across uh, Arkansas. And they also have the uh, Navigator program, which we also uh, run. And uh, they can enroll people over the phone as well. So they can call to that get their questions answered and call to get enrolled over the phone. Is the over the phone the most common way or is it through the website? It's the most common way, uh, you know, as a consumer, if you can work the computer well and know the terminology of health insurance, you can do it yourself, enroll yourself. That's not a problem. But if you need help or you want help, um, then uh, absolutely you can call the call center here at AFMC in Little Rock or you can call the federal call center. They also can help you enroll. That was my next question. So there is a federal um, call center as well. And that number is different? Uh, yes, the number is different. Let me just give it to you very quickly. The federal call center number is 1-800-318-2596. What is the Arkansas number? Is it di a different number, as you said? Uh, it's 1-844-355-3262. And you mentioned the Navigator program. What is that? Well, as a state-based exchange, there are certain things that we have to do uh, as required by the Affordable Care Act. And uh, for instance, having a website, a consumer-facing website, uh, having a call center, and also a Navigator program. So uh, AFMC also uh, does runs our Navigator program. And what they can do is navigators can enroll consumers without bias to any carrier. They can enroll consumers in, in these plans over the phone. And so that's what they do as, as navigators. And what is the broker helpline? Um, is that something different than this call center? Uh, basically what the, uh, the helpline does is that if a consumer calls in, now let's say they're in Northwest Arkansas and the consumer wants a face-to-face -face meeting, uh, the helpline uh, will have an agent closest to that consumer uh, available for a face-to-face -face meeting. So it's a very important tool for people who like, uh, you know, to engage face-to-face. Uh, -face. And in your website is for offers a number of different things for consumers, agents, brokers. It, it really is so important. Tell us what you find there. Okay, so for consumers, there's all kinds of information as to, you know, open enrollment, what the benefits are, uh, what a special enrollment period is. So there's all kinds of things for consumers to get some of their questions answered or look up information. It's also a site where our agents and brokers and assisters go to get information for them for their licensing because they have special licensing here in Arkansas. So uh, the the uh, site also hosts the state training, uh, which they need to do if they want to become either an assister or an exchange producer as an agent and broker. And this year for enrollment will look like any other. Um, so there's not any any major changes that are different than in the past. No, it's pretty much uh, it's it's on go and uh, yeah, pretty much the same as last year. There's no new carriers. There's uh, no major change in benefits uh, for either the Affordable Care Act or the uh, AR Home Program, which is our Medicaid expansion. But there are changes ahead, right? There are going to be a few changes ahead in 26, yes. Different uh, network uh, adequacy, um, 
uh, is going to be measured differently. So there's going to be a few changes, but consumers will not know that. Hmm. And this is an important time for healthcare providers. What do you want them to know that they need to, to tell their patients? They should be able to tell their patients throughout the year that they're eligible for health insurance. Um, you know, unless they don't have a special enrollment period. Like let's say they lose a, uh, their job or they get divorced, they're eligible to go on the Affordable Care Act plans uh, within 60 days after the event. So the doctors need to know that, uh, you know, if somebody loses their job or, or takes uh, leave or whatever, that they can get coverage within 60 days after the special event happens. So, Bruce, as we approach November 1st, which is soon, um, tell us what you want the general public and the healthcare community to, to know. Um, is the health call, the call center, the website, I mean, this is an, a really important time for Arkansans. It sure is. And our website, if you want some information, it's www.myarinsurance.com. Um, you can also call the call center if you have questions. And don't procrastinate is the big issue. A lot of people wait to the last minute and then they have problems, can't get on the internet or something happens and their uh, application gets uh, you know lost or whatever. So get going as soon as possible. If you need insurance and you want it for January 1st, get on that uh, <coughs> enrollment uh, as soon as possible after November 1st. Well, Bruce, thanks so much for joining us today and talking about this important information. I appreciate you. Um, my pleasure. Thank you very much. And that's it for this episode of AFMC TV. Thanks for watching and have a great day.